surviving the drylands. Grevy's zebra habitat and diet, the art of arid adaptation in the vast, sun-baked expanses of East Africa, where the earth often cracks under relentless heat and water is a precious luxury, lives a zebra unlike any other. The majestic Grevy's zebra, distinguished by its narrow stripes and large rounded ears, is a true testament to resilience. A creature exquisitely designed not just to survive, but to thrive in some of the continent's most challenging arid landscapes. Today, we journey into their unforgiving world, unveiling the secrets of their specialized habitat and the remarkable dietary adaptations that allow them to endure where others would falter. A land of extremes, Kenya and Ethiopia's dry heartlands, the Grevy's zebra calls home. The arid and semi-arid grasslands and thorny scrublands of northern Kenya and parts of Ethiopia. This is a landscape defined by extremes, scorching dry seasons that stretch for months, followed by brief, often unpredictable rains. Water sources are scarce and widely dispersed. And the vegetation, seemingly sparse, holds the key to survival for those equipped to utilize it. It is a harsh realm where every drop of moisture and every edible plant fiber is fiercely contested, demanding unparalleled toughness and an intricate understanding of the land. Beyond grass, the browser's advantage, unlike their plain zebra relatives, who are predominantly grazers, feasting on the softer, more abundant grasses of the savannas, the Grevy zebra is a master browser. This fundamental difference in dietary preference is a cornerstone of their survival strategy in drylands. While they will consume some grasses, especially after rains, their true strength lies in their ability to strip and digest tougher, more fibrous vegetation that other large herbivores often ignore. This unique foraging niche allows them to access food sources in areas where grazers would quickly starve, reducing direct competition and opening up vast, otherwise unexploitable territories. An ant eat or a tough menu, unlocking hidden sustenance, their diet is a testament to their remarkable digestive system and formidable teeth. Grevy zebras routinely consume a wide variety of woody plants, shrubs, and even the bark and leaves of trees. Acacia and camiphora species, with their often thorny branches and tough foliage, form a significant part of their menu. They will meticulously strip leaves, twigs, and bark from these hardy plants, extracting vital nutrients and moisture. In times of extreme drought, they can even turn to succulents or the roots of certain plants, showcasing an incredible versatility and a determination to find sustenance no matter how challenging the conditions. Water resilience, a crucial adaptation in a land where water is often a distant dream. The Grevy's zebra exhibits extraordinary water resilience. They can go for significantly longer periods without drinking than most other large mammals in their habitat, sometimes up to five days. This remarkable ability is partly attributed to their specialized diet by consuming water. Rich plants, like certain succulents, they can extract some of the hydration they need directly from their food. This physiological adaptation 
combined with their capacity for wide-ranging movements, allows them to survive in areas near far from permanent water sources, giving them a distinct advantage over less adapted species. This navigating the landscape, seeking sustenance their unique social structure, characterized by fluid, temporary groups and territorial stallions, plays a crucial role in their ability to find and utilize dispersed food and water. Individuals are not bound by rigid herds, allowing them the freedom to travel vast distances in search of the best foraging patches and elusive waterholes. The territorial stallions, by defending areas that often include vital resources, provide intermittent access points for mares and foals passing through. This adaptability in movement is as vital as their diet itself, ensuring that they can always reach the sustenance necessary for survival. Competition and coexistence. A delicate balance while their browsing preference reduces direct competition with common grazers like plains, zebras, and wildebeest. Grevy's zebras still share their dryland ecosystems with a host of other herbivores, including camels and livestock. B. The balance is delicate, and competition for dwindling resources can become intense during prolonged dry spells. Their specialized diet, however, often gives them an edge allowing them to utilize vegetation that is unpalatable or inaccessible to others, illustrating a remarkable natural partitioning of resources within these challenging environments. Threats to their table, a shrinking world despite their incredible adaptations, the Grevy's zebra faces escalating threats to their habitat and diet, human encroachment, habitat fragmentation due to fences and settlements, and direct competition with ever-increasing livestock, herds are severely impacting their access to vital foraging grounds and water sources. Overgrazing by domestic animals degrades the very vegetation they rely on and disruption of traditional migration routes limits their ability to move freely in search of sustenance. Protecting these magnificent animals demands safeguarding the vast, interconnected landscapes that are the foundation of their dryland survival. A masterclass in dryland survival, the story of the Grevy's zebra is a powerful narrative of survival against the odds. Their mastery of arid and semi-arid environments through specialized dietary preferences and an incredible resilience to water scarcity stands as a testament to nature's profound capacity for adaptation. By understanding the intricate relationship between their habitat and diet, we gain a deeper appreciation for these unique creatures and the urgent need to protect the fragile ecosystems that allow them to continue their extraordinary dance of survival in the heart of Africa's drylands. <laughs>